Hello, people of the world. CJ all day one one three zero here. You know what? I'm in a good mood. Why don't we play some games? Right here, I have my lovely little Atari seventy eight hundred here. Uh, this is a fun system, and I got some games here: Atari twenty six hundred and seventy eight hundred games. Seventy eight hundred games. I'm limited a little bit, but that's kind of expected. Um. I have eight 7800 games, but I have a lot of 2600 games. So why don't we play some games here, shall we? All right. So we got our camera set up. We got our TV set up. First game we're going to be playing is oops, let me turn the flashlight on. Uh, Dragster by Activision. It's a fun racing game. Um, it's basically a two-player game, and there are only two game modes. Uh, straight and uh, steerable, I think. All you have to do is press uh, left and the button. And yes, in Atari 2600, you only have one button instead of two buttons. And that was, that's basically it. It's a race. It's it's just a racing game. I know someone locally who actually um, uh, had a record in this game. Alright, so the next game we're going to play is uh, Space Shuttle, A Journey into Space. Now this is one of the games that James and Mike couldn't, wor uh, couldn't get to work, so let's try and get this to work. Okay, alright, so from what I can gather, all it is, is a simulation. Uh, that's from what I could gather, so let's, let's see what we can do. Alright, and it's a Na there's the NASA logo, and it's daytime. Uh, clouds are passing through. The countdown. Alright, here we go. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, Okay, okay, I want to show you guys this something. Okay, here's the joystick, and I'm moving it all around. I'm, I'm, I'm literally pressing the two buttons, and nothing is happening. I'm literally just pressing the two buttons, I'm moving the joystick around, nothing is happening. I believe it's a simulation, and I think we broke the sound barrier. <laughs> uh, but yeah, this is the game that James and Mike couldn't get to work because it was a quote-unquote pal game well I got it to work and this is it James this is it Mike it's a simulation that's it that's all I could gather alright so next game we have Star Wars the Empire Strikes Back now this is a game similar to Defender and it's it's the scene from Hoth all you do is you shoot down the AT-ATs that's all you do. Alright, so what I'm going to do is a strategy here. Okay, so what I'm going to do is a basic strategy. Okay. Ah. Ah, damn. I, I, it's working out. It's working out so far. Okay, so whoop. go back. Ah, there we go. Next ATAT. Hey. -AT. Ah, dang it. I'm trying to move my controller. But that's it. That's all you're trying to do is you're in the ho you're in Hoth and you're trying to shoot the shoot these uh ATATs down. That's all that there is to it. Okay, next game I can't get to work uh, at all. It's called Journey Escape. From what I can gather, um Journey obviously is the band from the 1980s and apparently uh, they have a game uh, made 
for them or, or something, you know, similar about, you know, about them or something. And from what I can gather, there's an arcade game of the same name. Actually, no, it's just called Journey. Uh, I'm, it's similar to the arcade game, I think. Uh, but let's find out. Um, yeah, I can't get the game to work, so... No matter what I do, the game just does not seem to work. I tried cleaning it, I tried blowing on it, nothing is working. Yeah, nothing seems to be working. Uh, I actually tried testing out every single game before I recorded so that uh, every game could work, but this game seems to just not work. Alright, next game! Space Jockey. This is one of the games that uh, James and Mike did uh, in their Atari Part 4 space games. So here we go. Space Jockey. Um, you're a jockey in space. That's, that's what I can gather. Okay, here we go. Space Jockey. Now, I really don't know what the objective of the game is. So, I really don't understand the gist of this game. What, 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 what part of space are we in? Are we in the nether regions of space or what? Are we in another planet with life in it? What is going on? Like, we're shooting hot air balloons, we're shooting airplanes, and we're shooting tanks, we're shooting helicopters, we're shooting buildings. What in the world is going on? We're shooting aeroplanes too. I don't get it. This game is so fun. It's so addicting. And at the same time, it's so weird. Alright, so that was Space Jockey. I don't want to waste too much time on you guys. Alright, so here's another Activision uh, two-player game. Uh, it's called Freeway, and what it is, is you are, get this, a chicken! <laughs> You're a chicken trying to cross the road, and it's a race, basically. It's a two-player game, obviously, and it's a race to the finish to see what chicken is superior to the next. So, that's all I could gather. I've played this game literally so many times on the PlayStation Activision Classics uh, library. Uh, it, it was on the PlayStation 1. And this is the game that I could just play over and over and over again with no problem. And, uh, I, you know what? Here's the, funny, here's the funny story about me and Freeway. I wanted the game so bad on my collection, okay? And I try to get the game, okay? First copy. I got from uh, 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 f the flea market. I got from the flea market for about uh, 50 cents, okay? The game did not work at all. No matter what I did, clean it, uh, blowing on the cartridge, cleaning the other part of the cartridge. No matter what I did, I, I couldn't get the game to work. Uh, second game, it was broken. Uh, there was literally a chip. Uh, in the uh, in the plastic, so it wouldn't go in the 2600, the 2600 Junior, or the 7800 for that matter. So that was the second game that didn't work. It didn't work at all, uh, as a matter of fact. This was my third copy, and you know what they say about the third copy: third time's a charm. So that is a true testament to the game. So that's that's Freeway. You're a chicken trying to cross the road to get to the other side. Yeah. So that's why, but you know what, that's that's a true testament to why the chicken crossed the road to get to the other side. Alright, so I'm still recording? Alright, awesome. Alright, uh, I got two more games. Uh, let's play some more. Uh, next game is a classic you may know called Pitfall. And this is a self-explanatory game. You're Pitfall Harry. And you're exploring the jungles. I'm trying to jump over it, but the jump button just won't work. Alright, here we go. Ooh, you know what? I have a better idea. I have a better idea. 
why don't we switch controllers? Because we're not going to be playing any uh, 7800 games until later in this in this video, so why not? Sorry, my ears are a little clogged up today. I don't know why. Here we go. All right, Pitfall. This is absolutely my favorite game of all time. Well, one of my favorites. You just press the button uh, to jump. Hey, look, 1995. That was the year I was born. Uh, okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Woo! I almost did not make that. Oh, that, I didn't jump. What the hell? I, I jumped. I definitely jumped that. Okay, here we go. Sorry, I'm trying to, uh, um, I, I'm, I'm trying to swallow, uh, so that I can, you know, get my ear unclogged. I don't know what's going on with my ear today. Alright. Woo! Woo, I almost did not make that vine. That's a rattlesnake. Oh, I almost did not make that jump. The only times I will not make the jumps are the alligators. I really don't know how they do it. Right, there we go. <coughs> I apologize for that. Oh, and... Oh, damn. Yeah, if you fall in, 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 in a ladder or in a... Uh, uh, in a in a, in a in a in a ladder hole or in a bigger hole, uh, you lose a hundred points. But if you fall into one of these pits here, you lose a uh, you lose a life. Oh my god! Oh, that was a whole bunch of baloney sandwich. I almost made that. Okay. Oh, money. Okay, so that gives you two thousand points if I'm not mistaken. I think a diamond ring can also give you 2,000 points. Oh no, the diamond ring is coming up soon, so don't worry about that. Oh yeah, the scorpion. They are hard to jump over. The scorpions in the bottom of the screen, they are flipping hard to jump over. Okay, here we go. Yeah! Campfire! Why don't we put out the campfire? Like, seriously. Alright, so there we go. We, we're, we're, getting, we're making progress. Here we go. Oh! What? I uh, might as well wait. Oh! What? Oh, that scared me actually. Holy crap! Oh crap! That actually scared me a little bit. Okay, diamond ring! I got that. So basically you're trying to live and survive this jungle within the three lives you have within the 20 minute time limit and try to score as much points as you can before you lose all your lives. So that's the gist of the game is you just run and jump and collect. Okay, here we go. Oh! I almost made it! Oh, dang. Well, that was pitfall. That was fun. Uh, what's next? Uh, how about real sports tennis? Real sports tennis, right over here. Okay. Real sports tennis, Atari 1983. This is actually the one of the many games, uh, one of the first games that you could actually input your name. Okay, so what I'm going to put in is my actual first name. What am I doing?
Oh, dang. It's basically tennis. Have you ever played tennis? No? Well, this is as close as you can get to the real thing. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, wow, that was close. I almost did not make that. This is actually one of the few games that you can input your name in. One of the first uh, uh, early games, actually. It's a deuce! I think he did that on purpose. Ugh! Dang. He's got the advantage. It's going to go back to deuce, actually. When that, when I, if, when, if I make a point. If I made the point. So I'm the guy in the blue. As you can tell, I'm the guy in the blue. Okay. Alright, so that's uh, Real Sports Tennis. And it is raining outside. Awesome. Alright, next game. Uh, why not play Jungle Hunt? Jungle Hunt. <laughs> this is actually one of my favorite uh, Atari games um, of, the, of, the, of the time I've been collecting. <laughs> Jungle Hunt is based off the arcade game. Okay, so what we do... Oof. Oof. Don't hang on too long though, because you will fall. Alright, so that was basically it. Oof. Oh dear. Uh, the next objective here is to... Oof, that was close. Is to kill these alligators, I think. Or crocodiles, whatever, with a knife. I really never understood this game, really. Oh dear. I think that's it. That's it? That's it? Really? Oh, no, 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 there's one more. Oh wow. Alright, and now, here's the fun part. Dodging the boulders. Oof. Oh, I'm flattened. I think you're supposed to dodge a set amount of boulders and collect a certain amount of points before you move on in the game. to the uh... Ooh! I never really made it that far. Holy crap. Alright, here we go. This is the hardest part here. Oh no! Shit. Oh! Go, 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 go! Go 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 Oh god. Alright, one more. Ah shit. Ah shit. I made it. Go 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 And you save your daughter. That's Jungle Hunt. This is actually one of the few games that you could actually beat. 
Oh god, that was hard actually. And you get an extra life for every 10,000 points you get, so that's Jungle Hunt. Alright guys, I apologize for the um, uh, the sudden camera stop, uh, but I was going to play more games, but you know what? Um, we're going to stop right there uh, after we did a couple of games. So, what do you guys think? Do you think I should play some more games? Uh, do you guys think I should play some other systems? Um, please let me know. I would like to. I would like to know. I would really love to know, actually. Uh, if 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 you want me to play some more games, uh, play some more systems, I would really like that. You know, because I'm sick of you know you know because I really want to play some other games. You know, besides PC games, I want to play some Atari. I want to play some NES. I want to play some Super Nintendo. I want to play some uh uh, uh some uh, N64. You know. Um, so yeah, please let me know. I would like to play some games, uh, with you guys. So, yeah. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys later. Bye.